Welcome, friends. Today, we're going to read a story about a turtle. It's called The Box Turtle, and it's written and illustrated by Vanessa Roeder. Let's go ahead and read. The Box Turtle, written and illustrated by Vanessa Roeder. Crack? When the little box turtle hatched, his parents noticed something missing. His shell. That's right, his shell is missing. Oh, me. Oh, my. But they weren't dismayed. They gave him a name and a shell, both of which fit just right. A young girl, a young is a box girl. That's right. Now remember, Terrence, you are so much more than just a shell. Terence's shell kept him dry on the soggiest days, safe from the snoopiest strangers, and on the scariest nights. Ooh, ooh. It was big enough to share. Terence loved his shell. Until one day. Your shell is weird. Suddenly, Terence's shell seemed too boring, too bizarre and too big for the little box turtle to bear. So he abandoned it to search for something better. Terrence searched high and low until, wow wee! His new shell looked sleek. But it showed too much cheek. Eek! The search continued. Ooh la la. He looked classy. He looked sassy. He looked just like Grandma Mildred? He looked for another shell. He found it. Oh yeah. A perfect polka dotty package. Pop. That was positively Petrifying. What's that mean? It means scary. It's not scary. <laughs> and it pops out. Terrence tried shell. Boom, 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 boom. After shell, hey, ee. After shell, buzz, buzz, buzz. After shell, arr, arr. But nothing fit. This whole situation stunk a lot. That's it. Look, I give up. Skittle, skittle. Here you go. Plop. Oh, wow. In that moment, the hermit crab showed what it meant to be a friend. The little crustacean was so much more than just a shell. And maybe Terrence was too. Terence knew what he needed. But when he found his old shell, oh no, it had changed. It's okay, we can fix it. Terence patched on soggy days. He toiled on chilly nights. I mean, work hard. The task grew big enough to share. Finally, the shell was finished. It wasn't sleek or sassy. It was far from perfect and definitely weird. But Terrence wasn't dismayed because this little box turtle was so much more than just his shell. The end. The end. Again? Okay. <laughs> what a sweet story about friendship and acceptance. Terrence loved his shell until other turtles made him believe that his shell is weird. Thankfully, Terrence has a hermit crab friend who helps him and also sticks by his side 
and is very loyal and helps him to believe that and helps him to see that it's okay to be different, be yourself, and to be proud of who you are. Trina, are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, I like your singing. We also should never let others bring us down for who we are, and we should never treat others rudely for who they are. Good singing, Susanna. We hope you had fun reading The Box Turtle with us. Join us again soon, and don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss the next books. Bye!